guys, here we are with another egg cutting. This is clutch 13. Uh, this was a special scaleless head male who was bred to a Marvel Mojave Passable Harlequin. Uh, we had six eggs and one of them rotted out completely. So we got six left. You can see where it was sitting next to a couple eggs. Made them a pretty, pretty nice and colorful. But they were in. It was in between these two eggs. Didn't make the others go bad. So we uh, we have another clutch. Same thing happened to. They probably rotted out right in the beginning because it was just a real nasty mess. We're gonna go jump right into this. Hoping for crystals. That's what I want. Crystals and Marvel crystals. If we can even tell what that would be. So. Shall we come on down and take a look? See what we get. So we have five eggs now. So I would say that is a Mojave. Mojave. And it looks like it is scale said. So a little Mojave scale said. For our first one. That looks like a crystal. I uh, don't know if it's scale set. I can't see ahead. And not sure if we'll be able to tell whether or not that is Marvel or not. Maybe when it comes out of the egg. But that's awesome. That's what I was hoping for. A crystal. Very nice. So a crystal is an allelic combo of Special and Mojave. So, really cool animal. And this looks like a scaleless head. I don't think it's a Marvel. And from here I can't tell if it's a Special. I would say probably not. But it is scaleless head. So... Two more. Another crystal. Very cool. Nice. Looking forward to see if either of these we can tell are Marvel. I'm hoping to not hit Scaleless Head in this. We'll see. All right, and this looks scale his head. Mm, either a normal or a special. That's it, man. I don't think we hit Marvel in anything unless it's in the uh, crystals. And I would say, from what I can see, I don't necessarily see Harlequin in the three that are not crystals. From my understanding, Harlequin kind of gives a nice backstripe. Cor That's what I understand, correct. And from what I can see in these animals, I don't really see a backstripe. Uh, but again, you know, when they come out of the egg, we'll be able to determine better. Um, I'm going to grab mom really quick, show you what she actually looks like. Just got to find her really quick. I moved her after she laid. I don't know where I put her. Later. So this is Marvel and Mojave. So got a lot more flaming here. The alien heads are a little bit more twisted up. This I'm assuming was where they thought maybe it was a Harlequin because of the back stripe on the back half of the animal. But, you know, looking at this, like this here, and looking at what I can see there, 
I would say there's no Marvel. But, you know, everything, uh, we, we might see more of the alien heads, obviously, uh, when the animals come out. And maybe we could determine whether or not there actually is Marvel in them. I'm hoping with the crystals when they shed, we'll be able to see that pattern a little more. I know usually once they get a little age on them, they, they brighten up a little bit. Um, and you could see the yellow or the gold color in them. And if that's the case, maybe we'll be able to tell if either of those have Marvel in them. But, yeah, this is Mom. So, as of right now, I would say looking at that Mojave, it's not a Marvel. And we'll see. No big deal, but that was what we were shooting for, trying to work this gene into some other things. So, definitely happy, though. I got two crystals. Uh, we produced two last year. That was what I was trying to do last year, and neither one of them made it out of the egg. So, I'm hoping, obviously, hope these two make it out, and then we'll have a hold back and maybe a uh, one to sell. So, very nice. We got a couple egg cuttings tomorrow. Uh, we'll either get to them tomorrow or Monday. It depends how busy my day is. Um, but other than that, we should have videos throughout the week. We should have an update on one of the clutches as well next week. Or this week, I should say, because it's, it's Saturday today. This video will come out on Monday. So hopefully this week we'll have an update for at least one clutch, if not two. Um, and then another week or ten days we'll have a couple clutches being laid. So make sure you check the links down below. Thanks again for swinging by. We appreciate it. And we'll see you on the next video.